Hey guys, Property Land Brothers. Today we're at District 14 at Trey Residences. This is one of the newest 99 year leasehold projects in the area and we have a compact three bedroom unit to show you on a high floor with gorgeous unblocked views. Let's go check out the unit. We're at Trey Residences right now and we're in the District 14 RCR area, rest of Central Region. Geylang, as everyone knows, is made up of the Odd Lorongs as well as the Even Lorongs and the Sims and the Gilamat area. Where Trey Residences is located is actually along Geylang East Avenue 1. We're just a three minute walk to Aljunit MRT. From Aljunit, it's just four stops to City Hall and also just one stop to Paya Lebar Interchange if you want to hop on to the Circle Line. So in terms of uh, connectivity and accessibility, this area is well loved by people who want to be near the city and love living along the city fringe. So about the project, Trey Residences TOP'd in 2018. The project is made up of two towers, 17 stories high. So because we're not along the Geylang Lorongs, we don't have that height restriction of 8 stories. We're allowed to go up to 17 stories and there are only 30 units of this three bedroom compact layout that we're in today at 764 square feet. The units at Trey Residences generally face either north or face south. For the north facing units, there aren't any three bedroom compact types. You predominantly have your two bedders, two plus study, your regular three bedroom as well as the four bedders. For the south facing units, the three bedroom compact, there are two stacks. So stacks 12 or 5 and you have a pool view and you're also facing towards the MRT track of Algeria. Unit MRT. So if you're after the compact layout, which is 764 square feet, and you want to enjoy a pool view, then um, you have these two stacks to choose from. We're standing in the foyer area now and the owners have spent about 100,000 on renovations about three years ago. They very tastefully renovated the entire unit. Right as you enter the unit, you'll notice that there are very little walkways in this layout, which is great because it means that there's very little wasted space in this compact layout of 764 square feet. Your shoe cabinets are located outside and over here, this is the DB box, which you can use as storage as well. And then over here, this is your open kitchen. Even though it's an open concept kitchen, there's still plenty of of storage. You have your washer and dryer that's tucked in here. You have a shelf here for appliances like your microwave and then more storage up above. And you have a very good size sink, solid kitchen countertop as well as a whirlpool induction cooker and hob. There's also an inbuilt oven here and more pull out storage space. Whoa. Oh no, this is a fridge. Oh, we have an integrated fridge. Over on this side, you have an integrated fridge here which conceals the fridge and makes your open kitchen look very neat and tidy. This is the dining area. You get a good way from your dining area to your kitchen. They've put in a six-seater here where you have a long bench on one side and three seats on the other. The owner has also done up very pretty statement lights in this dining area. We have your hanging pendants which will stay with the house. Taking a closer look at the three bedroom layouts at Tree Residences, you have the three bedroom compact, which is the layout that we're in today at 764 square feet, or you have your regular three bedroom layout, which is 861 square feet. Comparing the two, the main differences you'll see is that for this 764 square feet layout, you get a dumbbell layout where you have your bedrooms on either side of your living and dining area. You have a longer balcony, which spans from your living room to your master bedroom. Whereas for the 861 square feet layout, you have a more squarish balcony which runs off your living area only and you have three bedrooms which are all along one side of the unit. Another difference is for this 764 square feet layout you have an open kitchen whereas for the 861 square feet you have an enclosed kitchen. So you have a difference of about 97 square feet between the two layouts. In terms of pricing for the two different three bedroom layouts here you will notice that you have a price difference of about 160,000 for a size differential of 97 square feet. Looking at this disparity of quantum both both units don't have a yard and utility. The difference is quite marginal, so it would be entirely up to preference. If you are a small family and you don't require an enclosed kitchen, then this layout might be suitable for you. For a three bedroom compact, this is a very sizable living area. In terms of the renovations, they've done a feature wall over here 
with a wall TV, which is very nicely integrated with the feature wall. And then you have storage space down below for your sound bar and other electronics. And the fall ceiling and the downlights have been done up as well. Now let's head out to check out the view and what we're facing. This is a great sized long balcony. We like that it runs off your living area as well as connects to your master bedroom. Zip tracks have already been installed so you can have them down when you want to enjoy extra shade or privacy. Taking a look at what we're facing right here, we get a pool facing. We're also facing the Aljuna MRT track. So some of you might wonder if there's any uh, track noise from the MRT. You will get some track noise when you have the train coming into the station, but that is very mitigated from your double glazed windows. And it's also great that you can walk to Aljuna MRT in just three minutes. You also get to enjoy a very nice unblocked view because we're facing towards the Geylang Lorongs which have the height restriction of eight storeys. In this direction, you will have a really nice view of the Kalang Stadium as well as the entire CBD skyline. So this view is what you get to enjoy from your balcony. Now let's head back in and chat a little bit more about the pricing in this area. If you're after 99 year leasehold projects in this area, then you will have a couple of options, especially if you want to keep your quantum under 1.4 million. For this unit at Trey Residences, we're asking 1.32 million for 764 square feet, and we're one of the newest projects in this area that is just three minutes to Aljuna MRT. And then looking further outwards, we have Sims Urban Oasis, which is just one year older than Trey Residences. The prices there for a compact three bedder will range from 1.35 million to 1.5 million. For freehold projects, you have the water arena and three bedrooms there are asking between 1.6 to 1.7 million. On the odd or even Gelang Lorongs, you will find smaller boutique projects which are lower in height as well. So if you want to keep your quantum below 1.4 million dollars and you are after a newer 99 year leasehold project within walking distance to Aljuna MRT, then Trey Residences would be the nearest one just three minutes away from the MRT and you get a good sized three bedroom compact at 764 square feet at 1.32 million. So this unit has a dumbbell layout where you have two bedrooms on one side and then you have your master bedroom separated on the other side. And let's check out the first bedroom first. They have transformed this bedroom into sort of a walk-in wardrobe and a room for them to get ready in. The sliding wardrobe here, this is our original from the developer. What they've did is they've changed the laminate to match the add-ons that were added. This cabinetry is all new where you have full height wardrobe space for you to put in your luggage or to hang your full length dresses or clothing. You also have these very nice shelves for you to display your bags and other items. You have eight drawers here and that's plenty of storage space for you. This room also enjoys a very good size window to allow natural light to come in. If you want to reinstate this room into a bedroom, you can. You can just remove the existing cabinetry and joinery that's been done. Uh, we will show you a 3D rendering of how that can look like. And then coming over to this side, this is the common bathroom where you have a very nice marble finish kind of tiles on the walls. A vanity here with plenty of storage. Your standing shower is great size as well. This is a very well maintained common bathroom. And then let's check out the second bedroom. This room they have transformed into their home office. They've retained the original wardrobe from the developer and changed the laminate to this sort of herringbone fabric light laminate. And they've done up this built-in study area where you can easily put in two screens. In this room you have um, a full panel of windows so it's great to be facing natural sunlight while you work. You have a feature wall here that's been uh, wallpapered and all your bedrooms have a wallpaper feature wall. Now we'll head over to the master bedroom. 
This is the master bedroom and this is a really cozy master bedroom. We love that we have full height windows because we're also connected to the balcony from your master. This is the original wardrobe from the developer so they've left it as is because most of their storage is in the walk-in wardrobe so they've retained this. You have a queen size bed here and space for a single side table on this side. They put in a side table here where you can use as your dresser. This leads to your master ensuite. This master ensuite is a great size. You have your standing shower here and the vanity over here. Similar to the common bathroom, you have a very luxurious looking marble-like porcelain tile on the walls as well as the flooring. Flooring in all of the bedrooms are original from the developer and this is all engineered timber. At three residences, you get to enjoy facilities like a 40 meter lap pool, a wave pool, floating lounges, a barbecue bay, as well as a gym and sky terraces as well. For amenities in the area, you have malls like Paya Lebar Square, 1KM and Kalang Wave Mall. For schools, you have Geylang Methodist School Primary as well as Guanghua School. So this was Trey Residences and if you are after a 3 bedroom compact layout at 764 square feet and you want to keep your quantum under 1.4 million, you want to be within walking distance to Aljunit MRT, then do contact our listing managers Ayu as well as Ellen. My name is Beatrice, Property Lynn Brothers, always happy to show you the place. Fridge. <laughs> Can you open the fridge? Okay. For stacks 12 as well as stack, stack, what is the other stack? <laughs> Sorry, SOS.